button. We always start the parade with Vernon Unit's finest, as well as Nassau County's finest, our police and fire rescue and sheriff's department. transportation this year has been a fine partner for us and this year as the last couple of years we invited our guests to join us and our staff is on board as well in the shuttles good to see you all they do a fine job residents in all sleep hotel wonderful for extended stay or your short vacations just a short walk to the beach we're proud to be the sponsor again this year and thank you all for and B for your support we appreciate you the Grand Marshal, Aaron Rawls. Aaron has been messing with boats all his life when his daddy couldn't get you to work. What was she going to do? I know this because I grew up with him. Looking good, Aaron. Grand Marshal Burbank family, Emeritus. This, is, this year we have the Grand Marshal Emeritus. In honor of the 50th annual Isle of Bay Flag Shrimp Festival, we are honoring the Burbank family is the standard bearer for all the founding families of the Shrimp Festival. This is Tommy Burbank and his lovely assistant, Meg. Thanks, Meg. They are our Grand Marshal Emeritus. Uh, the Tommy and Billy could not be here today. The Burbank family runs the Burbank Sports Nets. They have been making nets for strippers and now for the sporting industry for over 100 years, and they're located here on Amelia Island. Thank you guys for all you do. Next we have the past Grand Marshal. I'll let I'll call off the list if they hear wave at them. If they're not wave anyway. Katie Cook, Captain David Cook, Ed Cook, maybe, if he could make it here, Captain Jim Dickey, Barry Woods, Martin Lentz, Al Bennett, Cecil Bennett, that must be brothers, Jamie Thomas, Annie Cook Jones, Captain Bunny Sterling, Rocky Darty and Nick Dionis. And Mickey Rushton. City of Fernandina Beach Recreation Park. Oh, yeah, that's Park. Oh, yeah. Parks and Recreation Park. There's two wheelchairs available for the public use at no cost. Dory and Emo were first to introduce Teal and Wheel. Fundraiser for Eight Flags Place Gate, where the 
Farms and Recreation Group raised $1,700 for this future included play playground. Thanks, people. For information about upcoming programs and events, you can go to the fbml.us. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Okay, next we have the little friends are happy in the plan because they have a whole good time. Miss Kate Pre-K. A school offers preschool for our twos, threes, fours. PBK and aftercare for their students and the Southside students as well. They love the little shellfish at Miss Kate's 3K. Next up, number 11, Pax Karate Academy. And I think today by Master Brian and Carolyn People. Teaching life skills, fitness, and self-defense since 1978 in Bernie Beach. Yes, 35 years. Students range today from four to grow up. Black belt, excellent, just taught. It's a game. Every student. Thank you. And I believe they have something to show us. Thank you. The Newcomers Club of Me Island will perform a line dance with 
to their version of Count on Girls. They are Tear. the Bernie and Girls, Newcomer Club of Lee Island. is over 520 women strong and offers over 30 different activity groups. Newcomers also donate to over 38 different community service organizations and charities in our local area. Last year, the club donated over $6,000 to these groups, along with food, clothing, and holiday gifts. All right, ladies, you're on the show now. Don't forget to say pretty. That counts. 
We do want to give special thanks to Larry Redmond of Redmond Boats and Yachts for being our chauffeur with his boats today. He is located at the Old Town Marina on North 14th Street and he sells Tidewater and Glass Street, glass street Boats. Thank you, Larry, for being here for us today and thank you girls for participating. Next up, number 21, Hughes Amelia Hair Salon. Hughes of Amelia Salon is honored to be included in the Shrimp Golden Shrimp Festival Parade with our own handcrafted golden shrimp created by Alan Baker. We would love for you to visit our friendly salon. We feature master styles and come in a comfortable atmosphere. And we hope our friends and patrons enjoy this, this year's festivities. So, appreciate your continued support. And look at this one for a treat, NASA Humane Society. And we also got a float. And the float is featuring dog and cat cartoon characters fishing for golden shrimp. The float is being led by an adoption wagon. And some of the dogs are available for adoption. The float is being pulled by the NHS truck, driven by shelter director Greg Place. Following the float are volunteers staff and in front of the float who work to help provide and care for the animals needs. Your NASA Humane Society located right here on the island relies on donations to provide care and shelter for these homeless pets until they find their forever homes. Thank you for being here. The National Humane Society is teaming up with the Shrimp Festival this year to raise some funds, they get funds for the National Humane Society. They will be selling these lovely golden shrimp necklaces during the festival to raise funds uh, in conjunction with the Shrimp Festival. Plus, they're going to have a park for paws. It's going to be over by the Human Comfort Station here by the Welcome Center. But it's a place where uh, pets can get some refreshments and get out in the sun. This is float number 23, Big Burns Foundation, and sponsored the second annual Big Burns Runway Round. This round will take place on the runways and taxiways of Burnham Beach Airport on September 14th. This rally is in memory of Ben Bros, who loves outdoors, running, serving, and flying. The rally ties all these things Ben loves to do. We're raising money for the Boys and Girls Club of Nassau County, Nassau County Humane Society. Other planned activities include free flights conducted by a local EAA chapter. So please come and join us for this unique 5K rally. More information will be in the news later next week. Now, I want you to check it out. Um, this is courtesy of the Pepper. And check out these tires. I tell you what, those tires are some running tires. Can you get those in the dealerships? <laughs> Hey, welcome Fantastic Gymnastics. Would like to perform for us for in first three. Fantastic Gymnastics has been serving Nassau County for over 16 years and now located in a 5,000 square foot facility by 9607 Chester Road in Uly. Fantastic teaches gymnastics to children two and a half years old at all levels. Come and see them perform at the 16th annual Clip Fest Saturday, May 18th, held in a new facility. Performing today is the fantastic gymnastic team and fast, fantastic all-star cheerleaders. And there are pirates lurking about. There is 34 Habitat Humanity House built in front of the beach. These homes are made possible with the help of dedicated volunteers and generous donations from individuals and businesses within our community. Keep up the good work. <laughs> you know, starting in 1972, Amelia Island, Beach, Uly Chamber of Commerce was the home of the Shrimp Festival for many years. We're proud to be part of festival history, representing today. Board of Directors and the Chamber's large business members is Chairman Bill Moore, Director of Planning Development of the Reimagined Omni Million Plantation. 
representing the Chamber's mid-sized business, Paul Clark, for is providing the car for the Chamber. Representing the Chamber's small business is downtown Fernandina's newest restaurant, Hula Cuban Cafe. Finally representing Chamber staff is President Regina Duncan and Communications Director Amelia Hart. Good to see you all. Thank you. Number 27, Early Precious Development Center, Incorporated. You're never fully dressed without a smile, Early Impressions, and the vibe, a dance studio, in addition to five and six-year-old dancers performing a clip from Annie. The vibe is currently been rolling now and for its amazing summer camps and dance, theater, art, and karate. Early Impressions also have the, has their famous Summer program registration going on as well as the free VPK signs from both locations. There's something for everyone, so check us out and see what the buzz is all about.
Barnabas Center is the foremost nonprofit organization in Nassau County. It provides critical service to connect people with help and hope. Through its crisis assistance program, food pantry, Samaritan medical and dental programs, Barnabas reaches more than 5,000 people each year. Barnabas thanks its many volunteer supporters and new to you donors and shoppers for their efforts. This year, Barnabas has launched its Building More Room for Compassion, a program campaign to support its future location on Jasmine Street. Thank you, Barnabas Center. We are excited for the 50th annual anniversary of the Shrimp Festival Parade, and they are also excited and proud to announce the 40th anniversary of the school. They are right up your shrimp towel. Come join family in the Young Monastery School. Thank you. He sits out front of our body shop here and gets quite a few visitors every day. We stop to get a picture with him. He can also be found in nearby parades and car shows, even birthday parties, which is the first appearance of the trip festival, so you can tell him he is loving it. We hope you have some grand to ride it. Lincoln, Taylor, Keegan, Brandon, driven by John Selvig. Boy Scout Troop 152 of your league. Troop 152 is chartered by the Uli Lions Club and celebrating their seventh year in scouting. This summer, four scouts and one adult will be representing Nassau County at a Boy Scout National Jamboree in West Virginia with 10 great scouts in the troop. And just last year, they have worked on several community projects, fulfilling well over 1,000 volunteer service. Three of these scouts earned the highest rank in scouting of the Eagle Scout. Congratulations. Great job, scouts. Remember, scouting is always trustworthy, loyal, helpful, friendly, courteous, kind, obedient, cheerful, thrifty, brave, clean, and reverent. Boy Scout Troop 152. Float number 33, the Maritime Museum of Amelia Isle is a nonprofit organization dedicated to the education and history of Amelia Isle. This includes nautical history and its related subjects. The float sponsors Amelia Research and Recovery, whose company provides recovered archaeological items for display. Float participants include Ms. Annie Cook Jones, Ms. Taylor, and volunteers of the Maritime Museum. The vehicle is driven by Billy Taylor, the curator of the museum, and his son Tate. Hey, favorite turtle is welcome on Amelia Island, Sea Turtle Lodge. Formed over 25 years ago, Amelia Island Sea Turtle Lodge is dedicated to the preservation of sea turtles. Its volunteers patrol the beaches each morning at sunrise during the nesting season, which is May through August, as we know. Thanks for what you do, Amelia Island Sea Turtle Lodge. Thank 
Next up, TNT Dance Forces celebrate the 50th anniversary of the French Festival. We are celebrating everything we know and need to know about the festival. We have dancing shrimp platter for all the yummy food at the festival. Our little dancers are showing their artistic side with paintbrushes, future shrimp fest, banners, and fireworks. Let's get the celebration started with our dancers and let's not overlook the king of the festival, King Shrimp. He is over 14 feet long and 10 feet tall. Don't forget, every king deserves a golden crown. Ladies and gentlemen, everybody, is very creative. I see pink. I hear pink. Welcome, little women. Little Women began in 1952 as a club for high school girls to learn social grades. Today, the club has evolved into a respected service organization, the 86 High School Senior, Junior, Sophomore, Young Women. The service community has become an important element of Little Women. The Foundation, the Federation of Women's Clubs, the Turning Unit, and Sponsor District of Young Women. Little Women, thank you. TFS, the basic mission of TSS is to promote interest and participation in amateur swimming. While developing positive individual, team and sportsmanship skills in a safe and firm environment. TFS involves the entire family in the sport of swimming, either as a swimmer, spectator, or an official. Families make TFS successful. For more information, please check out our website. Council on Aging, Nassau County. The Council on Aging operates the only transportation system in Nassau County. They offer Meals on Wheels, adult day health care, in home services to seniors. There's room for you or yours in the two senior centers, Turner Community and Hilliard. Council on Aging, Nassau County. Next up, the Golden Shrimp Award, Baptist Medical Center. In honor of the 50th anniversary of the Shrimp Festival, Baptist Medical Center presents the Year of the Golden Shrimp and the Golden Shrimp Awards, honoring the themes of the past 50 years. And they're going to perform for us. There's more beads coming. Welcome to the 2013 Golden Shrimp Award. Baptist Medical Center Nassau is honored to be presenting this year's Lifetime Achievement Award. The nominee's determination, hard work, year after year, has made a spectacular event what it is today. The past few past golden performances from this year's honorees include Homegrown Shrimp, Pick of the Litter, Culinary Creations of Shrimp, and Shrimping Through the Years. Not only they have become a vital part of Fernandina's hometown pride, they're asked to help helped out by Fernandina on the map. And the winner of this year's Golden Shrimp Lifetime Achievement Award goes to Isle of Eight Flags, 50 years, great years of outstanding shrimp festival performance. We bow to your honor and congratulations on 50 years. Y-N-C-A! Yeah. 
winner is right, but not the YMCA. So the glitter of the golden string. At the MacArthur Y, we are the Youth Development Healthy Living Social Responsibility. Believe that lasting personal and social change can only come about when we all work together to invest in our kids, our health, and our life. That's why the Y Sprinkling Community is our cause. Today, our float is created and represented the Also by the prime time students and their families, teachers, teachers, our right, our YMCA. Next up, U.S. Coast Guard Auxiliary. This facility is Marie Louise, one of the boats operated by the U.S. Coast Guard Auxiliary, 14-01, based at Ferndale Beach. USDA, a CD of the auxiliary assistant of the U.S. Coast Guard and Marine Safety Patrol, safe boating, training classes for general boating community, pre-vessel exams and teaching elementary school children safe boating. The USDG auxiliary meets the first Thursday of the month at the Media Island Lighthouse on Hagen Drive. First Thursday of the month, you can do that. Get your first lighthouse. I see a big truck. P.U. Florida Public Utilities, huge sponsor again this year. Got electric, they also, they got gas. I tell you what, Bob, we could not do the festival without Florida Public Utilities. They put in all the extra electrical needs that we have so that we can cook the food and do the entertainment. So we thank FPU for all that they do for Christmas. FPU is always a great partner in the community. CBS and Fox 30 afternoon has brought their very large satellite truck. This truck is a major tool to help bring you your breaking news and run the coverage every day. They can broadcast, broadcast live signals anywhere in the U.S. with this truck. Action News was recently in the original Ed Edward R. Award for overall excellence. It's also one of the 2013 Suncoast Media Award overall news excellence. Action News is covered too. Don't give up that easy now. I might work around the back. I like to work on your Look at this slot, everybody. The Home Depot. Oh, oh, yeah. Home Depot would like to say happy golden anniversary to everyone. I'm going to tell everybody. They're honored to be part of such a special celebration. Of course, King Strand. Have fun. Have fun. Everyone has fun. And always remember, more saving, more doing is the power of the Home Depot. Suncoast Vision Center and Tanning, Sun Gallery at the Nassau County Fair. Vision Care Center offering quality, quality so affordable vision care with a huge showroom and over 2,000 St. Bass frames. There's something for everybody. Costa Mayo Gym, Oakley, Ray-Ban, Prada, Dresden, Spy, and many others in their stock on the Saddle Road location. Sun Gallery and Tanning is the same location that offers the best state of painting art and you need free spray hands. I saw how you stumbled over that word Versace. You know? <laughs> <laughs> just couldn't say it. <laughs> it's okay. It's <laughs>
mixing techna techniques, athleticism, and strategy. The fast-paced and exciting sport of roller derby is the fastest growing women's sport in the world. Empowerment, exercise, sisterhood, and team Sarah are the mindset that we strive to provide to each and every member. Want to see what the sport has to offer? Come check us out Mondays, Thursday evening at the Peck Center. Tough Scott Pack, 353, Tough Scott Pack. 353 from Fernando Beach is led by Tough Man, Doug Lewallen. Here's a group of boys who work there, way up from Bobcat to Weber Scouts, in first grade into the midway and fifth grade. This is where they start preparation for Boy Scouts, and they're about more than just hanging out with friends and boys and learn how to be the best they can and grow in spiritual, mentally, and physically. Learn the skills that will be the with them the rest of their life. The Nassau County Property Appraiser's Office. No, you don't. The Nassau County Property Appraiser's Office presents the 2013 Shrimp Boat Race. Participants include the Anna Maria, the Mary Catherine, the Golden Nugget, the Ebb Tide, B and B, Fort Clinch, Miss Melody, Captain David, Lady Anne, the Golden Isle, Miss Nina, Miss Nina Joe. Jody Jones and the Dixie Queen. These are all names of shrimp boats that have graced our harbor Dixie and been in the shrimp boat parade. So, a lot of race for us. A race. A race. Here we go. Appraiser, my kickoff. Stand up, Mike. Come on. Good job. Who won that? The Dixie Queen. Oh, there it is. Sorry, how could I miss that? Way to go, Dixie Queen. Dixie Queen won a lot of shrimp boat races back then. Go, Trent Gatti, will outrun everybody. That's right. Enjoy as they entertain you with their swashbuckling antics. Dance along with everyone's favorite giant shrimp as he boogies and protects his booty. Legend has it, the more you cheer, the more golden shrimp will shake. I said, legend has it, the more you cheer, the more golden shrimp will shake it. Because every shrimp in Scalaway deserves a chance to do that. Next up, Chick-fil-A. Honor Miss Leader Fanny, we would like to perform in front of the judges. The local Chick-fil-A is here 50 years to celebrate 50 years of shrimp. Cow version. Of the Harlem shake. Let's see it. Hand out, big, big. Ready. <laughs> <laughs> Turn to the Beach, Babe Ruth, top corner. 
Bernadette Beach Pond Water Association of Bernadette yeah. Beach Babe Ruth League provides eight. football, cheerleading, baseball, and teaches good sports. Honesty, yeah. loyalty, courage. In order to challenge the kids to become trustworthy young adults. Babe Ruth, Pop Warner, thank you. The Allen Museum of History, the Maritime Museum of the Allen, is a non-profit profit organization dedicated to the education and history of the Allen. This includes nautical history and related subjects. The close sponsors are many of the Island Research and Recovery, whose company provides recovered archaeological items for display. Close participants, Danny Cook Jones, Mr. Taylor, and volunteers. Oh, okay. Okay, you're gonna rewind a little bit. This is the Amelia Island Museum of History. So sorry, we had things in the wrong place here. They're replicating a float from the early 1970s. For many years, the Bernadine Beach Pirates Club were well known for their iconic float, which was designed to look like a pirate's brig. During the float's procession, the pirates would pick up onlooker, onlookers and lock them in the jail, in the cell. Eventually, the pirates would trade their brig in for a full pirate ship, complete with firing cannons. Don't forget they're offering an exhibit of the 50 years of the ship festival over at the Museum for June. Thank you. The St. Augustine Royal Family, St. Augustine Easter Festival. The St. Augustine Easter Festival Carriage is provided by Avalon Carriage Company, owned by Murphy and Carriage Family. The 2013 Royal Family, Queen Mariana, portrayed by Leslie Good, Princess Margarita Maria, portrayed by J. Russell Carter, King Carlin, portrayed by John Patrick Ray, Rajo, all three trace their family heritage to many families of Arriving in St. Augustine after the city's founding in September the 8th, 1565, the trio represents the Spanish royal families that commissioned the building of St. Carlos San Marcos. Thank you. We're happy to have the royal family with us today. Speaking of royal, the Ritz Carlton, Amelia Island. The Rich Carlton Emiliano is excited to celebrate the 50 year anniversary of the Shrimp Festival and is privileged to be part of it for the last 20 years. We congratulate the town of Fernandina Beach on a very successful 50 years and look forward to 50 more. Thank you, Rich Carlton. You always do a great job. Red Otter offers the best outdoor lifestyle brands on the market, including Patagonia, North Face, Merrill, Bacaloni, Chaco, Southern Pit, Thai. Stop, stop by either location to see, see how good looking it feels great on the hand. Red Otter, Red Otter's entry is entitled we ought to celebrate 50 wonderful years of shrimp, golden shrimp, and 10 great years of red otter. Red otter clothes and coming by a few of the great staff to help you with the location. <laughs> And a late entry into our parade is the Amelia Dream Cars, the Crab Trap Restaurant, and Amelia Hotel at the Beach in this beautiful vintage. What is it? 442. Oh, sorry. Anybody? Female. Female. Don't let me think Beautiful. Thank you, guys. We appreciate these the fine businesses who support the festival. Welcome to Kinder Studio School of Performing Arts. We're dedicated to bringing all forms of dance into theater, fitness, and visual arts to our community. We're excited to also bring the new fitness grade Amelia, to Amelia Island Dance Trace, a high and workout program, which is all over the world. And Kinder Studios would like to perform for the children. 
Here we have Cat Clinic. What is more fun than kitten playtime? Kitten playtime with shrimp. Four adorable kittens playing with golden shrimp. Three jumbo shrimp play toys and these galore at Cat Clinic Fernandina. Our calm, quiet atmosphere and gentle touch can change the most ferocious tiger into a furry kitten cat. A cat clinic of Fernandina serves all of our cats. Veterinarians ranging from dental cleaning, boarding, grooming, annual vaccine. So remember, if your kitty goes a bit overboard on shrimp, cat clinic of Fernandina is the perfect place for people. Veterinarian care. Cat clinic. Big Brothers Big Sisters of North Face Slaughter is one of the mon monitoring mentoring program with Black and Matches Youth, the mentor to live in the community. Our mission is to make lifelong friendships that make a difference in a child's life forever. Today we are sponsored by, sponsored by our amazing big and little as well as their families. Start something and make a difference. Live big. Uh, next weekend for the Shrimp Festival. So come on down and try to win a prize. Thank you for the day. Oh, I hear it. The whole family big truck. And this is the family Arts Alive Nassau offers free after school art and music for our elementary school children. Founded and led by Jane Lindbergh, the nonprofit group has programs in three schools already which plans to expand. Whether it's playing hard, playing in the band, learning an American instrument, called it Lucifer, or coming and budding artists, the amazing new group has given back to our schools what the tight budget has taken away. These children and their parents represent arts and live programs at Emma Love Hardy and Julian Mendel. This is Arts Alive Nassau. We ask you to help keep these arts alive. Next we have the Ocean Highway and Port Authority with the Board of Commissioners. We are proud, they are proud to be a part of the 50th anniversary of the Shrimp Festival. We have Chairman Brian Reeves, Vice Chairman Carol Franklin, Secretary Treasurer Richard Bruce, Commissioner Ronnie Braddock, and Commissioner Danny Fullwood. Thank you guys. Welcome Amelia Massage Associates, professional therapeutic body work proudly serving our community since 1995. Yes, we do next, we do shrimp. Yes, the island's favorite giraffe love her neck massage. Nothing tastes better than locally massage. Thank you, Amelia Massage Associates. Next up, the Hilliard Middle School Band, commonly known as the Flashes. Check out the Earth Friendly Gate at our downtown location across the palace. 
theme of the Go-Yo will float is Mermaid's Paradise. The Go-Yo the Mermaid from Go-Yo, the Island City are a very exotic form of sea life. They roll into the island and can be found at the Go-Yo City on South Bay Street. They are known to magic powers and transformation. They have a large following of humans who have experienced a huge energy and vitality through doing yoga. Dance and do yoga with the mer mer magic mer mermaid. Center at First Coast Highway or visit them on the web at Cold Builders. Me, I love Cold Builders. Yeah. Welcome to Christian Motor Cycle Association.
1998, located on Silo Road, across from the post office. All, all pro offers a complete line of repair and restoration services. This is Big Black. 525 by horsepower Ford. And we're on two and a half tons of military axle, 49 inch tires today. Two radiators, three cook electric cooling fans, a 30 gallon windshield washer system. It's owned and operated by Jenkins and and piloted by Michael Davis. Please join us in the year to go to the
Thank you. Everybody be safe. Have a great